Hello, welcome back to the Freak Show. Bumpy McSquiggums here. I want to thank you all for joining me as it's time for us to go hang out with Adley or Atoli, depending on how you want to say her name. That being said, we're playing the Dot Hack at GU series. This is Last Recode. Technically, we're still in Volume 1. Obviously, we haven't gone too far or done too, too much. I'm still learning most of how the game works, everything else. But that's neither here nor there. It's time for us to continue with our very the amazing Lux stuff. Dog, our destination today. Yeah, yeah, you already said that. Uh, I have to invite her, don't I? No, I already did. Yeah, that's right. Let's go. Does she do you think she's going to help us this time or just kind of be like a, a non-starter, we'll say? Book Mock Blurry Obsessive Slacker. Or Delta Blurry Excessive Slacker. Oh, look at that. Hmm. We have, we have two negatives on the treasure level. I don't, I don't want to It's fine. It's totally okay. Oh, Adley, we need you as a clerical healer for our arena life, yes. Thank you so much for saying yes on such short notice. You're welcome. Thank you for bowing to me. I'll work hard to make up for last time's fiasco, too. Deal. Well, you know what they say. It's always best to be prepared, right? Well, the Boy Scouts say that, I think. That's why I went and bought these items for us, Maybe. just in case. Is that a Boy Scout thing? I have no idea. Hey, smoke screen. We can run from battle and return feathers. What? We can be birds. Smoky birds. We can be a smoky oh, bird. Man. Oh, boy. Here we go. <laughs> Captain whines a lot. She has no interest in leveling up. These will come in handy, right? Uh, yeah. Thanks. No. That I woke was... up early today so I could log in and make preparations for us. Uh-huh. It's so fun. It's almost like we're going on a picnic. Uh, yeah. Weird. Seems like she's in a good mood. Maybe she'll be more willing to help with the arena than I thought. Hmm. I'll hurry up and get her to the beast statue, then ask her about the arena. Where? Come on, Haseo. Let's go. Let's do it, Haseo. Okay. Let's do it. This is the shortcut to the beast statue. To the beast statue. Um, wait a second. Let's go this way, Haseo. Hmm? But isn't that a dead end? Oh, come on. Oh, come on. It'll be fine. Okay. Well, let's take a look at her map. I guess we're going to the dead end. Why is there a thing behind us? What's going on over there? I want to go over there. It looks... Alright, whatever. Oh, she can't ride with me? That would have been so cool. Well-ish. Cool-ish. Oh, sweet. I can just mow stuff down with the bike. crash the stuff oh look over there that is odd huh see that mirage like thing over there in the distance I do it's kind of blurry but can you tell that there's a big machine there yeah I can well that big machine is called the crest gun a long time ago, humans filled that machine with the power of the goddess Aurora and fired it at the realm of the gods. Sounds awfully mean. It resulted in the gods being destroyed by their own powers. It wasn't wrong. And the human beings had to live with the guilt of being god killers. Why would you tell me this story? It's know, terrible. That story's part of the world background from the official site, right? That stuff's just made up. But in this world, is it's it? the truth. Is it though? Even if it is fiction. The feelings of pain and sadness that we feel here in this location are, in fact, very real. Yeah, like hell I feel that. I'm sure that feeling in itself has meaning. Weird, huh? I think it's the little things like that that help connect us to this world and each other. Okay. No, it's just you. <laughs> <laughs> you find this Still boring? A jerk. Should I stop? Hell yeah. Uh... Haseo? Is something wrong? Well, I don't really get it, but I guess that way of thinking might be right too. Yep. Okay. 
Then let's go to the next spot. Oh, there's more on this wonderful tour of horrible sadness. Wonderful. You know, I'm excited. Well, Adelie, I'm going to go kick this thing because I haven't kicked anything in a while. Yeah, the aqua board. I don't know what that means, but I'm going to go mow down some things. Okay, tough guys, bring it on! Aww. Well, I'm not real sure how that works 100% yet, so... It's gonna be a work in progress, for lack of a better term. No, don't hit me. Don't hit me, Tom Cruise! Oh god, he's doing stuff. He succeeded. Don't hit me. Hey, hey, hey. Don't mess with, don't mess with Adelie. She's just kind of standing there. Screaming like a little... Oh, oh, wait. She did stuff. Way to go, Haseo. Yeah, yeah, it is. We have a way to go before we're done with this crazy shenanigans. Oh, oh, there's a limit to the Rengeki. Okay, well, I just learned something new. That was nothing. It, it, it wasn't nothing. Well, she's getting closer to the next level. So that was a bit of a mess. I apparently failed my bike thing, so my bad, yo. That didn't work either. Whee! Yeah, soil bug antenna. Are we gonna go look at the weird little island to the south? Yep. Nailed it. Oh, it's adorable. It is. Haseo, Haseo, look over there on that small island. Can you tell if there are birds there? Yeah. How cute! Wish I could touch him. I just love birds. All kinds of birds. Like canaries no. or sparrows. Birds suck. I don't like birds. In fact, They're noisy. I named this character Atelie after a bird. Atelie after a bird. Is that right? <laughs> and you? Huh? Where'd your name come from? I had mayo, and I combined uh, has mayo together and it became Haseo. No? Nothing? Yeah. Oh, I, I, I thought that was pretty on nothing point. Nothing worth talking about. Oh, come on now. Whoa, whoa, no what are you doing, lady? Tell me. What you, I told you what mine means. Uh, <gasps> what? They flew away. I guess our shouting scared them off. It's not ours, it's your, your uh, shouting. Maybe we should go too. I don't know how I put up with her. It's all very weird. Okay. Well. I guess it's bike time. Ha boom, baby. Let's go. Brr, brr, whoa, boy. Oh, please tell me I hit him. No, I didn't. I failed again. More like a... More like a... Uh-oh. More like a fail blade. Huh? Something like a fail boat? No, nothing. Oh! Well, he didn't do a lot of damage and he hurt himself. But then I missed because I'm good at doing things. Catchy man! Gale wrecked. Have you learned your lesson? Yeah, you tell him, Atoli. It's Adley! I know. I know. I know. Aha! The symbol fragment. Kick him! Kick him all! Chim! You're not a chim. Where did the big chim go? Aww. Yes, I did it! I'm a hero! 
go back to talking about what a hero I am. Die! Ren Geki Blade! Alright. Well, these things are super pathetically, overly, amazingly weak. Get him! Have you learned your lesson? Rough shell. Alright, what are we doing? Who's on first? Uh, yeah. And run Geki style. Yeah. Got him. Oh, I thought I had him. I done failed at having him. Alright. The Lazardian Hunter will not stand. I just hope our gal can survive long enough for me to get over there to save her. I feel like she's probably not the person you want to bring into an arena, I'm just saying. Have you learned your I have, thank you. Thanks for checking on me. She's almost caught up in level, look at her. Doing stuff like a grown's up person. Making grown's up decisions, it's good stuff. I still think I prefer it the other way, where you just charge at him and kick him. But it is pretty cool to be able to run him over with a motorcycle. I'm not going to sell that short. It's pretty nifty. That's right, I said the words nifty. Deal with it. And Ren get it. Tully, do you, like, do... Sorry, Adley, do you do... I'm going to try to remember just to say it that way, instead of doing both. Do you actually have any physical attacks? Or is it literally just your weird, I'm here, I'm gonna get hit stuff? With an occasional heal. Have you learned your lesson? We got double Rengeki that time, that's mildly impressive. I'm <sighs> just slightly beyond halfway now. She's still cruising along pretty nicely though. Alright. Let's get to it. Oh boy, that did not work at all how I had planned. Whee! Ah, hmm. oh, almost. Alright, what do we have? Pretty much you done though, it looks like. Alright. Get on over. And I think we can bring friend Gekki finish this, maybe? There it is. Will it be enough though? Yep, it most assuredly is. Alright, way to go, Haseo. And that might be enough to level her, I think it is. There she goes, she caught up to level 10. She's clearly better at this game than we are. The fragments have started to shine, and with those three fragments, Captain Planet is formed inside the temple. Now, if only that wasn't the lamest thing ever. It's pretty lame, I'm not gonna lie. I feel like there's another fragment over there. Oh, uh, yeah. In the world... People are supported by a steam-based culture that they have invented. The powers of steam are shared by the chim-chims with people like us. Because that's not weird. That's part of the game's background. Yes, but you and I are currently inside of that world, right? We're both here, right now, living in the world. Uh, yep. <sighs> that's why... 
You shouldn't forget about things like gratitude or consideration just because we're inside of a game. Yeah. I think that we have to. We need to treat this world properly and open up to it. Yeah, stop being such a jerk, man. So, Haseo, have you ever Ooh. met anyone Whoa. in the world you could open up to? Yes, she know. Oh. No, chase down the, the chim chim, kick him. For me, that special person is actually Sakaki. Oh, not you. And you too, Haseo. Ah, oh, there it is. There's the Haseo now, love. Let's keep going. It's all very. I, I guess it makes a little bit more sense. So she's trying to treat this as she should. I mean, like, when you're doing stuff online multiplayer, you shouldn't always be super rude and mean and angry and nasty. People in real life make mistakes. You don't generally tear them to shreds. Sometimes you might, but I don't know. I, I'm I'm definitely guilty of this as well. I'm not always the nicest person when I play multiplayer games. I used to be a lot nicer, but that's changed over the last, let's say, year. Hazel, are you tired? Dota 2 was always the no. exception. It's always Just me. a little bit further. We're almost there. Let's go. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, no, ever since I uh, started playing certain titles with Colonel RPG, my uh, tolerance factor of people hey, and Haseo, silliness dropped way. a bit. Haseo, come on, hurry up! Over here, it's this way! Wow, she's so excited. Good for hey, there's a thing over there. See? Isn't it amazing? They're flowers. What? What is she doing? Look at these flowers. Isn't it nice? It looks just like a real field of flowers. <sighs> Haseo, what's wrong? Didn't you like it? It sure is something. <laughs> something messed up with your head, that is. <laughs> I know, isn't it? This is number 15 among my all-time recommended places. 15? So you have a top 20 or something? Uh nope. I've got 132 altogether. Wow, that's pretty oh, specific. I see. Why don't we keep going? Mm. Oh. What is it now? <laughs> a lucky animal. A lucky animal. Let's kick that's it. A, um. Awesome! It's the gold bird. No, stop! <laughs> hmm. Sorry. Huh? can't kick it! Yes! You'll hurt it if you kick it! Exactly! Come on, Haseo, hold it in! Endure! If you get mad, there'll be no hope for the arena. Yeah, you're right. I guess it would be kind of mean to kick it. No kidding! That's right! Besides, look how cute it is! Damn it! And it was a real gold bird, too! Which is probably important. I think taking leisurely walks like this is what really makes the gold bird happy. Me too. So let's just leave him alone, okay, Haseo? Hey, Adelie, what's over there behind that field of flowers? <laughs> oh, okay. Let's keep going then. <clears throat> this is cringy. It's a little cringy. Oh, it's right. It's taunting me. Can I go kick it? Where is it? Let's kick it. I want to kick it. Can we kick it? I'm not going to kick it. Come on now. That's just mean. Why would anybody want to do that? I've been saying that all, all along, that the uh, kicking of the aminals has been a mean. But yeah, no. No. Uh, some interesting things. We got another aqua board. I should probably get on to motorcycle dome. Oh, there's more things to run into and murder. Sweet. Yeah, I'm getting them bug antennae. Antennae. Antananai, Antananai. Ah, boo. No. Let's just try to. There it is. Oh, I could have just gone around behind him and done it. Eh. No. I will not allow you to do that to me, friend. You can do that, but that doesn't do any damage. Gale Blade! Done and. Ah. Done. Oh! 
he healed somehow. Didn't he? Wasn't he down to 10 HP at some point? I feel like he was. Ah, well. Well, I'm gonna go around the backside. We're gonna go find that guy, give him some chims. He's right there. Oh, look, they're circling. It's wonderful. It's that again. Be a bud. Sorry, guys, if you want me to not skip his dialogue. It, this one is a bit different. But it just seems silly to see Slash here the same thing over and over again. But if you want, I'll stop skipping the skipping of the skipper, of the skippitude. Got an earth spike. Oh, there's two more battles to have over there. Alright. Oh, well, it kind of worked. That wasn't exactly picture perfect or super pretty, to be honest, but I'll take it. Ren Gekin. Hey, she hit him. I saw damage numbers. Hey, hey they have swords in their mouths. That's adorable. Throw it a block. I don't remember. I don't know there being a block mechanic, but I'm sure there was one that exists somehow, somewhere, somewhere. Oh yeah, there is. That's right, heal me, woman. Heal me while I gale blade him down. No. No lessons have been learned. Hey, blade thorns. Alright, let's do this. Oh, that's right. Let's see if I can screw this one up. Down, A, A, up, X. Whew. Barely had time for that. I was like, wait a minute. That's not just regular buttons. There's D-pad commands in there, too. Whatever am I going to do? Succeed, apparently. Ah, full speed attack. Aseo. Dodged another kill blow. I feel like my attacks are quite short. That does cause some issues. That was nothing. Okay, we got the toidal toidal shell. Feeling pretty good. We're gonna go on in here and we can get stuff handled. Alright, into the temple of doom in a minute. This is shadows out there. Okay, I thought I saw something else out there lurking in the outskirts. But I didn't. You like how I run in a straight line? Left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. See, I can run in a straight line if I had to. I just choose not to. What did you say to me, woman? What did you say, Adelaide? I don't know. The change necklace. You get more, uh, like, metal coin money with the change necklace. Well, that was weird, I guess. Uh, everything looks beautiful. Uh, was there something else I was supposed to do? I'm a little confused here. You're tired of being jerked around by Adelie. Gather the symbol fragments and head to the Beast Temple. Did I... Well, apparently my mic cut out here for the last few minutes, so they're going to go through this big dialogue, and I'm just going to be quiet while they do it. So, I thought I had already done everything, but when we leave here, it's going to trigger a cutscene. So, I'll be back once they're done talking. <sighs> I'm sorry. I guess we didn't gain very many experience points, did we? No, but these excursions aren't so bad every now and then. I'm so glad. I don't really care much for simple level raising. That's not why I play the game. If you're always concerned with numbers, then you won't notice all the beautiful things around you. And that would be a real shame. Hey, have you ever been to the arena? Like, fighting it? No, I haven't. 
I find the whole idea of players fighting against each other kind of scary, really. Is it? Defeating other people just so you can build up your rank? Well, to be blunt, I hate that kind of thing. But, you know, I think it would be good for you to learn a little bit more about the world. Can I ask you something, Haseo? What? Do you really enjoy winning over other people? What are you talking about? Yeah, who doesn't? I don't. Or rather, I've never really had a chance to win anything yet. But I do know what it feels like to lose, and how painful that can be. This place... It was used as a quest when I just started playing. It was a time attack quest. I came in dead last because of the way I am. And everybody laughed and made fun of me. Since then, I stopped participating in competitive events. So, that's why you don't like the arena. It's not just the arena. Having a higher level than others, finding better weapons than others. So what is that supposed to prove? I mean, what's the point of defeating your opponent just to show off your power? Well, it's only natural for players to want to be strong in an RPG, right? Yeah, but Haseo, there's no goal in that. Personally, I think it's also really important for us to slow down and, and stop. And to enjoy things like flowers blooming around your ankles. Nice things like meeting all sorts of new people. Slow down? Stop and to enjoy? <laughs> it's impossible! I can't take this anymore! What are you, an idiot? Huh? All of this! All of this! All of this! is nothing more than a bunch of computer data! It's just a bunch of fake stuff made by slapping textures on top of polygons! How the hell do you find any part of this made-up world beautiful? <gasps> Haseo! There's only one thing that's real about this world, and that's us, the players! Getting stronger and defeating your opponent! Those are the ways that all of us keep connected! That's the way this game is played! What's wrong with that, huh? Answer me! Tell me, what's wrong with that? I... I... Leave. Huh? Damn, you're so irritating! Don't show your face again! <gasps> Damn it! Don't go telling me crap like slow down with Shino's face. And in case you were wondering, ladies and gentlemen, that's why they call him Captain Smooth. That's right, he is now known as Captain Smooth. All the ladies love him. So yeah, he's an exceptionally rude and crude guy. Now granted, she's a little insane too, so... Double insanity? I don't know. The whole thing was just strange. But we did okay. We got our B, triple S, B, which gives us the A rating. I'm okay with that. You know, our surprise attacks definitely need some work, but that's pretty much going to do it, ladies and... Oh, oh. So much for the third player for the arena. Might as well go back to Canard's at home and report. Yeah, so we're going to go back to Canard home in the next episode. But for now, that's pretty much going to do it for this episode. Again, I'm not sure why my mic is cutting out. I hope it doesn't continue in the future. But either way, we'll make it work. Until the very next episode, ladies and gentlemen, my name's Bumpy McSquiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by The Freak Show, and I will see you later.